Welcome to Buzz Around the Globe. Israel's military released security camera footage Sunday. It said showed hostages being brought into Al Shifa Hospital in Gaza City on October 7th after being kidnapped during Hamas's attacks on southern Israel. Al Shifa Hospital has become a focal point for Israel's subsequent military operations in the Gaza Strip, with the army repeatedly saying Hamas uses it as a base, a claim the military has been under pressure to back up. The militants and medical staff have denied that a command center is under the hospital. The first clip, which appears to be timestamped 10.53 a.m. on October 7th, shows a man in shorts and a pale blue shirt being dragged through what looks like an entrance hall by five men, at least three of whom are armed. In the second, seemingly timestamped 10.55 a.m., an injured man in underwear is wheeled in on a gurney by seven men, at least four of them armed, as several men in blue hospital scrubs look on. Military spokesman Daniel Hagari described the two men as hostages from Nepal and Thailand. The CCTV footage appears to have been shot on the morning that Hamas gunmen began storming southern Israel, killing around 1,200 people, mostly civilians, and kidnapping some 240 others, according to Israeli authorities. Since then, Israel has pounded Gaza relentlessly from the air, land and sea with officials in the Hamas-run territory, saying 13,000 people have been killed mostly civilians. Israel claimed these findings proved that the Hamas terrorist organization used the Shifa hospital complex on the day of the massacre as terrorist infrastructure. Hamas dismissed the footage. It had repeatedly said it had taken several captives to hospital for treatment, particularly because some had been wounded in airstrikes by Israel. Earlier Sunday, the Israeli army said, troops exposed a 55-meter-long terror tunnel 10 meters deep underneath the Shifa hospital complex which ran under the hospital and ended at a blast door. Hagari also gave more details about the death of 19-year-old soldier Noah Marziano, who was taken hostage. The army announced on Friday that troops had recovered her remains in the area of Al-Shifa. Hamas said she was killed by an Israeli airstrike, a claim denied by Israel, which said the militants murdered her. Hagari said Marziano was being held by the militants very close to Al-Shifa hospital. Hagari claimed, during ongoing combat in the vicinity of where she was held captive, Noah's Hamas captor was killed and Noah was injured, stressing that her injuries were not life-threatening. Citing concrete intelligence, he said, Hamas terrorists took Noah into Shifa hospital where she was murdered. He said her body was later dumped outside the hospital on an orange stretcher where troops found it. This is Israel's proof of the use of the hospitals by Hamas and in their eyes, a validation of their military actions on the hospital. 19-year-old IDF Corporal Noah Marciano was taken hostage by Hamas terrorists during the massacre of October 7. Noah was taken into Gaza alive. She was held hostage by Hamas in Gaza City next to the Shifa hospital. During ongoing combat in the vicinity of where she was held captive, Noah's Hamas captor was killed and Noah was injured. I repeat she was only injured. An independent pathological report has determined Noah's injuries were not life-threatening. I repeat, Noah's injuries were not life-threatening. What happened to Noah? The world should ask what happened to Noah. According to the intelligence we have in our hands, a concrete intelligence, Hamas terrorists took Noah into Shifa Hospital, where she was murdered quickly. Hamas murdered Noah inside Shifa Hospital. This is 7th of October, 10.55 a.m. The evidence I will share was sent by Israel to diplomatic channels to the countries of those civilians. Here you can see Hamas taking a hostage inside the vicinity. He doesn't look even, he even doesn't look, needed treatment, but they're taking him inside the hospital. I will now share this video that shows the same hostage entering into the hospital with the gunmen, terrorists inside the hospital. This is the main entrance of the hospital. Quote, this is at 10, 55 a.m. They're entering another hostage, gunmen are entering another hostage, from those countries I mentioned, into the vicinity. The terrorists are guarding the room. We have not yet located both of these hostages and rescued them. We have not yet located them. We do not know where they are. They're still hostages we need to rescue. Do tell us what you think about this video in comments section. And for more news updates, subscribe to India Today.